Did we wake up at the same? I've been up since four. I've been thinking a lot about this. New York is where real writers live, and I am starting to think that I am a real writer. Why didn't you tell me? Do not say it. Careful now. Keep it to yourself, Linz. I just have all these voices in my head all the time. Now you've done it. Nice pants. Thanks. They're new. I mean, they're not new. I wear them a lot. Sounds like they have a very rich history. I know exactly what you're gonna say. I wasn't gonna say anything. Just enjoying the view. You don't need her. Mama's here. Okay, that's creepy. I came here to focus on myself. This could be a life-changing opportunity. You have no reason to believe that. What about this reason? It's funny, the devil's actually a very misunderstood card. Did you always want to be a writer? I think I always knew I had something to say, but just afraid no one wanted to hear it. She doesn't like you. She just thinks you're rich. Hey, don't listen to her. You're doing great, buddy. What are you thinking about? Nothing. I've listened to so many different people telling me who I should be. What are you doing? It's different with Lindsay because she's special. That is actually very sweet. It's time to give up and come home. I belong in this city. You've been hit by three cabs. At very low speeds. All those voices floating in her head, saying no in a million different ways. They don't see what I do. She doesn't appreciate you. She doesn't deserve you. This isn't your life. This is my life. I am sick and tired of everyone telling me what I'm supposed to do. Ooh. I need to find my own story. You're gonna be okay? I can handle it. <laughs>